What happens when you leave liver and margarita for a month? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning and happy birthday, Rhett. Hey. Thanks, Link. Now, to celebrate at my least birthday. 40 freaking two. Yeah, at least. I get to make an announcement. Hey, look at me, birthday boy. The Bleak Creek Barbecue Bonanza giveaway where two winners and their guests get an all expense paid trip out to LA for a very mythical pig picking with us and the crew runs through November 2nd. All you gotta do to enter is pre-order our novel, The Lost Causes of Bleak Creek, and submit your proof of purchase at bleakcreek.com. Yeah, multiple entries for multiple books are allowed, yes. plus tickets to our Bleak Creek Conversation shows count as proof of purchase too. Void were prohibited, no purchase necessary, full rules on the website. Now it may be autumn in this hemisphere, but here at GMM it's always margarita season, especially for the birthday boy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Do I get claps every time I say that? Were you hoping they yeah. bring you a margarita? You may not want to drink the margaritas that we're gonna have uh, put before us yes. today because today we are returning to the strange shelf that we leave things on, which we call the shelf that we leave things on. We've done Coke, bleach, air, Guinness, salt, pool water, nail polish remover, mouthwash, champagne, shamrock shakes and whiskey, a 93 Infinity G20, and now it's time for Left on a Shelf Margarita Edition. You know how this works. We're gonna be presented with an item and two options for what happened when that item was left in margarita for a month. If we get three or more right, we get to try a margarita <laughs> with a twist of link in Ew. Good Mythical More. Whatever that means, I don't know. We've got this bowl of grapes. What happens to a bowl of grapes when you leave it in a margarita for a month? Mm. Does it A, swell and burst, like the comfort of my childhood bubble when I realized the world was a harsh and unforgiving place? Wow. Yeah, I remember that. Let's go back to that moment. Or B, change color, like the hair of a 41-year-old still trying to be relevant on YouTube. Mm. I would say 42-year-old. I'm 42, by the way, 42. 42. Smell wow, smell and burst. I mean, okay, so I don't know what the active ingredient other than alcohol is in margarita mix. It's it's like a, it's a sour, it's a, it's like maybe a citrusy thing and sugar, right? So you got sugar, you got something citrus and you've got alcohol. I think they do swell a little bit, but I wouldn't think they would burst. So I'm, I'm saying change color. I'm leaning towards that as well. All right, here I don't we know. Go. Let's go with our instincts. Change B, color. Change color. Let's see if we're right. Whoop. Uh, oh no! What I don't? Well, I think there's definitely. Did it swell and burst? It seems that there's other there's grapeishness that has mean. gotten into the. Uh... Now some of these have changed color. There's no bursting happening here. So oh, these are bigger down at the bottom, but they're still not bursting. Well, I would definitely say that. We're we're correct. That is, I mean, they've started it. Well, they've they've only, changed, they've changed their texture. I think the bigger question is, what's it taste like? Because I I, th I think they changed color only subtly, but they did. So we got that one correct, right? Yep. Um, but let's take some of these that have changed the color the this most. Is, this is safe, right? It's margarita. Margarita never goes bad. Margarita. Whoops, that would have been a a mess. Thank you. Ooh, that's salty. They put a lot of salt in that margarita jar. Ooh, that's strong. You'll notice when I ask, is this safe? I didn't hear anybody respond. Nobody said anything. <laughs> then we just ate it. <laughs> um, I, wouldn't rec I wouldn't recommend that. It's too, ooh, it's, eesh. It does make the grapes purdy though. Now you can like put them on display. Just don't let anybody eat them. So this is, what are you calling this? A chicken, chicken cutlet? cutlet? But it's. It's it's a that's probably not the official name. It's a form of um, additional support when you don't want to wear a bra. It's like when you're wearing like a strapless or backless dress. I it's, mean, it's so sticky in there. And then they stick to your boobies. I mean, it could it could just be like a chin prosthetic. I could use that when I don't have my beard. Look at that. Hmm. Is that convincing, <laughs> Doc? <laughs> Doc, I think I have a problem. Yeah, we might need some makeup to blend that in and okay, make it more yeah, convincing. Yeah, we'll do that. All right. But here's our options. Will the stick on bra left in margarita, A, stick on a boob, 
like Chase during that game, we're not allowed to play at work anymore. <laughs> <laughs> or B, fall off of a boob like Quentin Tarantino when he sees some plump toesies. <laughs> All right, so th basically uh, they're telling us we're gonna have to pull this thing out and, and stick, stick it, it on a boob. To a boob. I don't know who's, who's volunteering for that. One, one of us probably okay. should volunteer. Um, I'll volunteer my boobs. This Let's just sticky. get that out of the way. Uh, and of course, I've got, I got a little hair on my boobs and you probably do as well. A lot, I got more than you. So okay, that's why so you we'll go with me. Now this is very sticky, like try to pull that off. Do you? Oh yeah, wow. Well that's, uh, that's effective. Uh, yeah. So it's still sticky. I don't know enough about what. Well, hey, don't We're reveal. Don't it. reveal. Um, but well, I, I, there's no way that it will sugar. still be sticky. And there's a lot of salt, as we discovered in tasting those. So um, you think that would dissolve the adhesive? Yes. It's, it, it, it's it most likely, to, right? right? It's got to fall likely. off a boob, man. So we're gonna go with fall off a boob. Fall off a boob. Let's see. And of course, there it is. We're not learning anything yet. Uh, so why don't you take this out, out and now present my boob? <laughs> okay, for for science. You want the right one or the left one? Um, the left one's a little bit bigger. So the right one needs to be made bigger. Oh. <laughs> okay, all right. So I'm gonna pull this thing out and uh, I'm gonna move this out of the way so as not to impede uh, the action. Oh gosh. <laughs> Did it? Move around a little bit. Oh. Nope, it's gone. But you know what? That'll do you. Yeah, let's just keep that in there. That'll do you. Now you, now you won't have a headlight turned on in the middle of our show. Uh, so we were right. We were right about that. We are two for two, and you are boo for boo. Feeling good. Okay, a water balloon. We're specifically asking a question, what happens to the water inside of the water balloon? Mm -hmm. So did the water inside the water balloon, A, take on a strange new taste, like my great grandma's lips at her funeral. Ooh. <laughs> Lean in and get one last kiss. <laughs> or B, remain tasteless, like kissing great grandma on the mouth at her funeral. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do that. Thought about it. All um, right. Yeah, it's a, this, is, this is really a question of the permeability of the balloon. I mean, if you were to just ask me this question on the street, you know how you like to ask me questions on the street? Hey man, I'm wondering if uh, if I put a water balloon down in a margarita. Right, mm -hmm. you, yeah. know, you know. I follow, yeah. If, uh, mm -hmm. if we left it there for a month, what do you think would happen? Mm -hmm. Well, I would think that the, uh, the balloon itself would prevent anything happening to the water. But, because you're not asking me this question on the street, you're asking me this question in the context of a internet show called Good Mythical Morning. Yeah, we are. Which has been produced for interest factor. You I think, think, and this may be a cheat, I think it's taken on a strange new taste. Against mm. all odds, and against my current understanding of balloons. Balloons are permeable. Really? It's not like a condom. We are saying strange new taste. And let's, Okay, that hurt, that hurt my finger. Okay, now it's open. Now we don't know what the water tasted like before, but we assume that it tasted like water. It has swollen, look at that. Oh. Oh. Well, it also may just be that slightly. It was that big. Sorry, right. put it over here and I will. Now, I'm gonna, I, I wanna dry it off, because I don't wanna yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah, we're, sci this, we're scientists. We, is we this don't, clean? We don't wear lab coats to seem like scientists. Do you, do you know if it's clean? No, okay. All right, so just hold it over here and I'm just gonna pierce the bottom of it. Oh! <laughs> there we go. Milk it's it? It's a nice little, don't, no, don't, you don't need to milk it, just. I feel like I need to milk it. Look at that. And then we're gonna have to, okay, that's plenty. It comes out a lot that's like milk plenty. comes out of a cow. Yeah. And then okay. just put that in this. Oh, oh, <laughs> did, oh we didn't splash back into this, did we? No, we didn't. Okay. Is Only it, way to tell it is scientists have to do things at the same time. Well, I can smell your face. I can smell that it smells. <laughs> I can smell that it smells. Smell of that. Hold on. That's margarita water. <laughs> the margarita Whoa. went through the balloon. It is strong too. How is that possible? It, I What's think, up with balloons these you know days? What? I think just the alcohol went through. No, it 
more than just the alcohol. The it, whole margarita. It has a saltiness. It has it yeah. has a hint of margarita. What? We are three for three, and we left a bonsai tree and a margarita <laughs> yeah, for Yeah, we did. Month. Poor bonsai tree. Uh, did the bonsai tree left in margarita A become spongy and flaccid like SpongeBob at a cheap massage parlor? Uh, <laughs> or a cheap massage. Or B become bent and spotted like Sophie Dossi with chicken pox. Ah, <laughs> yes. She, she's Friend very, of the show. She's very yes, bendable. Yeah, right. Uh, once you get it, you don't have to worry about it. But you can get measles. We don't bring measles into this, Rhett. If we have to start a band right now, are we gonna be spongy and flaccid or bent and spotted? Uh, I think maybe bent and spotted. It's okay. a little, little less incriminating. Well, who's bent and who's spotted? I'll be, I'll be spotted. Okay. I'm, I really have no preference, but I'm, I'm going with B. And what we say to the crowd, right before we strum our first chord, we're like, let's get bent and, and spotted. <laughs> Is that what we're saying? You think it's B? bent and spotted? Yeah, the leaves and stuff, they get spotted. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, bent and spotted. Ooh, that is a big jar, the big lid. Now, it turned brown, but it's, it's not spongy, is it? Pull this puppy out. Now, it's gonna be heavy. You might have to, ooh. <laughs> it's still a bonsai. Oh, up, up, up. That's fine, just up. Oh, just up, oh man, you inked it. It's inked, it's like a, it's like a scared squid. Oh. Oh, oh, it's so noise. it's so spongy and flaccid. Mm. Is it, oh, look at that! Look, look! I'm just oh, look how spongy the wood is. It's so flaccid. Oh <laughs> my gosh! It's it's hard on the outside, but really spongy oh, look, on the it's inside. It's like this wood pulp. It's margarita pulp. Here before us, we have pig liver. I'd rather not look at it. Looks a lot like human liver, but it's not. But what happens when you put it in margarita for a month? Does it a remain unscathed? Like Ja Rule after Fire Fest. Yeah, what? Well, come on, How did that hey, come on, Ja Rule. How is he still it like still Ja Ruling it up? Or B, rot and die, like Defy Media. <laughs> okay. Hey, well, I mean, we, we, we kind of benefited from that. <laughs> yeah, All right. To be hmm. Remain unscathed is my is my initial reaction. I think in this case, the alcohol content of the margarita and the salt content of the margarita. It's gonna like. It's a preserving. Oh, you think that the salt would. Yeah, you'd be like, oh, put this liver in salt for a month because I'm gonna eat it in a month. There's a lot more liquid put it in there alcohol salt, though. because I'm gonna eat it in a month. Either way, we're gonna eat it, right? And that we, yeah, right? Okay. okay. Yeah, I well, think we've, it and, and we've already won the red arita. Yeah, right. Whatever it's Margareta. called. Margareta. Margareta. <laughs> so, uh, all right. Remain unscathed. A. No. Nope. Oh, no, we were wrong. No, no, something happened to it. All right, so. The sugar, the sugar it. got to it. Do we need to open it? Yeah, we have to open it. Oh, good science. No, 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 it stinks! It's my birthday, so I'm not touching it. Oh! oh. It smells fine over here. It's horrible it over here. Like raw like, liver over here. There's a cloud. Oh gosh, oh gosh, you wafted it towards me. Yeah, you, man. Take it out, yeah, man, yeah. take it out. Take take it, it you out. have to take it out for science. Yeah, science? Yes! This is what the scientists do every day. For our benefit, they're in those labs with their lab coats, reaching into nasty jars and pulling things out. Uh, so we can advance as a human civilization. It's it's hardened. Mm, this pig been drinking too many margaritas. Uh, oh, you know what? Yeah, <laughs> we should have thought about that. Cirrhosis. Cirrhosis of the liver. Cirrhosis of the liver, but you know what? As gross as that is, we still won! We get to enjoy the margarita Ugh. with a twist of Link and Good Mythical More. I and of course. Eat anything. We also left Link's glasses in margarita for a month. Huh. So that's where those have been. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Summer, and behind me is Lake Targagagog Mantagagog to Bunnagungamog in Webster, Massachusetts, and it's time to spin the Wheel of Mythicality. That place doesn't exist. I'm sorry, what was that? <laughs> Click the top link to see what happened to a Burger King Impossible Whopper left in Margarita, Inga Mythical More. And to find out where the Wheel of Mythicality is gonna land. It's been a while, so we're dropping new styles. Prime members get free shipping on our latest releases at amazon.com slash mythical.